Hello and good evening. This is Elijah Gishoro. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support. President William Ruto has appointed uh, the De Director of Public Prosecution, uh, Nurdin Haji, to be the new uh, Director General of that, the National Intelligence Service. Uh, so, until his appointment, DPP was the Nurin Haji was the DPP and he has served in that position for over six years. One thing we, we can remember about the current DPP is that there's a point when President Ruto was being accused of the Arol and Kimorel dam scandal. But the DPP came out in defense of the deputy president then who is the president and said that there is no evidence linking the president to the Arol and Kimorel dam scandal. Could this be the reason why the president hired him? Arol and Kimorel was a national project. It's not about the deputy president. Mm -hmm. It's about a national project that was applied wrongly. Mm -hmm. um, it was about commercial loans that were taken to the detriment of Kenyans. Right. It has nothing whatsoever to do with the deputy president. So when the Arol and Kimorel case was happening, the president was the deputy president then. The deputy president was in the file and I said very clearly uh, that uh, he was not in the particular file that is before court. The DPP was on record saying deputy president William Ruto's name has never been mentioned in the scandal arousing questions of his political allegiance claims he strongly denied. Uh, but also uh, Nuruddin Haji has had a lot of experience in, in the intelligence and he was formerly in the intelligence before he joined government as the director of public prosecution. President Uru Kenyatta also attacked the pre uh, current president William Ruto, the then deputy president, and accused him of swindling or stealing three billion from the Aror and Kimoret dam scandal. Listening. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Uh, so <coughs> the president uh, appointed Nurdin Haji, and he has, you, have, you have seen you guys. He was like a quote unquote silent de defender of His Excellency uh, William Samuel Ruto. So his appointment uh, read like uh, this: His Excellency the President has, in exercise of the presidential prerogative vested in the head of state and government caused the nomination of the next director general of the National Intelligence Service. The presidential action is to facilitate transition of the apex leadership of our National Intelligence Service ahead of the retirement of Major General retired Philip Washira Kimeru, elder of the Order of the Golden Heart, the outgoing director general. Major General retired Kameru, EGH was appointed as Director General in September 2014 after an illustrious career having risen through the ranks to the position of the Director General of Military Intelligence in the Kenya Defense Forces. In that position, he provided outstanding leadership that earned him international accolades. Under Major General retired Kameru's watch, Kenya's premier civilian intelligence agency made monumental strides in the fight against terrorism, transnational crimes, and other major threats to our national and regional security. Major General Retired Kameru has been at the forefront of guiding special security assignments and multi-agency coordination that have made Kenya and indeed the region more secure. On behalf of a grateful nation, His Excellency the President wishes the outgoing Director General good tidings in all his future endeavors. Consequently, 
it is notified that His Excellency the President has, in accordance with Section 71 of the National Intelligence Service Act, nominated Mr. Nurdin Haji, Chief of the Order of the Burning Spear, for appointment as the Director General of the National Intelligence Service, NIS. Mr. Nurdin Haji returns to the National Intelligence Service after a six years sojourn as the Director of Public Prosecutions before becoming the nation's apex public prosecutor, Mr. Haji served as the deputy director of the counter organized crime unit within NIS. The nominee holds a bachelor's of law LLB, master's of law LLM, degrees from the University of Wales, Cardiff. Additionally, he holds a second master's degree in national security policy, which merit MNSPO from the Australian National University. Mr. Haji was admitted to the bar in the year 1999 and therefore joined the public service in January 2000 as a state counsel at the Attorney General's office. His Excellency the President has transmitted the nomination to the National Assembly for consideration by Parliament in fulfillment of the legal requirements set out under the Constitution and the National Intelligence Service Act, signed by Felix K. Kosgei, Chief of Staff and Head of Public Service.